Hi guys, I'm Rahul and welcome back to Frapper Aqua. So this video is about uh, water change during uh, discus breeding, which is a very important process that everybody knows. So, uh, but the difference between water change in a regular discus tank and a breeding tank is that if you use the regular siphon, a lot of the babies and all will get sucked in because they're really tiny in size. So what I do is I use a thinner pipe and stuff like that. So this video is all about that. So stay tuned. water that I have removed from the breeding pairs tank this is one of the major difficulties what uh, we face uh, with breeding discus because these babies get uh, stuck to most of the waste so out of this I have caught about you can see the babies so this is one of the reasons you need to be really careful when we are doing water change, uh, when this case is laid eggs and uh, so I have caught about six of them, <laughs> they have come into the pipe. So yeah, so there is some more water change to be done and yeah, so hopefully I don't lose any fries. So this is one of the most tedious and you need a lot of patience to do this. Yeah, otherwise you lose all these beautiful babies. So I'm using a rod like this. Uh, I've connected a thin PVC pipe. So the water intake is very low. And um, putting the water into a transparent bowl. So it's easier to catch the babies. to change so with this batch I don't think we've got any other babies So yeah, it's a tedious process but yeah, we have to do something like this. I place the bowl in a white background so it's easy to find out if there's anything moving. So yeah, currently there's nothing much. So this is one of the major difficulties of water change during discus breeding. So we are the third time. We didn't get fourth time actually. We haven't caught any. So yeah, this is pretty clean enough. I'm not going to do more. So there are a few babies which have attached to the parents already, and about uh, six babies that we've caught. I think we'll have to put them back. Yeah. So now these beautiful babies go back to their parents. I'm just gonna release them into the water. They come back into the tank and now it's time for them to find their parents. Not sure here. If you actually gone to their parents already. And if you can see these guys, yeah, they're all here. So these are the few things uh, which we have to do if you're 
the proud father few things that we have to be very very careful with uh, breeding discus so these babies are really tiny and see already you cannot find them not bad they found the parents it doesn't like me too much we them some good food and these guys will be happy this is some mushroom black ones which are stuck to the glass and they just got scared of the camera Sit down on them. So, hope you guys like the video. If you did, please do give us a thumbs up, like, and share our videos. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please do subscribe to our channel. <laughs> And yeah, we are also there on Facebook and uh, Instagram. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description. So I'm trying to put up uh, more uh, videos and small clips of the upcoming projects. So please do uh, try and follow us there for like kind of more regular updates. The next video what is coming up is basically I picked up a new um, air pump for my entire uh, racking system and my discus tanks a common uh, single air pump with uh, some uh, multiple output output so basically like the installation of that and stuff so uh, stay tuned guys lot of new videos coming up and lot of updates a uh, lot of videos that i have shot i have not yet uh, uh, you know completed editing uh, so that's what so there's a lot of stuff coming up so stay tuned guys and thanks for all your support cheers man bye